Hi friends, welcome to my channel. I want to talk to you about the word gap. A gap can be an empty space or an opening in the middle of something or between two things. For example, you can say he has a gap between his front teeth. And he has a gap between his teeth. He has green eyes. There were a lot of Susans. Redhead, big gap in her teeth. Gap can also mean a period of time. I personally had a gap of seven years between my school and university. And then there's a 12-year gap. You can say, for example, there's a five-year gap between her two children. And there is a collocation, a gap year, which typically means say, a break or an academic year between school and university taken by a student to do whatever they want before studying at university. That's, that's why I'm taking a gap year. No, take a gap year. Gap also means difference between two things. Let's say... You see, there's this gap between animals and humans. There's a big gap between those who earn 1,000 and those who earn 10,000. We were always miles and miles apart with this gap between us. Or you can also say there's a big gap between demand and supply. When something is lacking, it's also a gap. For example, you can say a gap in education or a gap in knowledge. Let's say somebody hasn't studied math in their life and you can say there's a gap in this field or there's a gap in their education. But there seems to be a big gap in my education. These big gaps in my memory. We need to help them fill this gap. Fill in some of the gaps. To fill gaps in conversation. I hope it was useful. Subscribe and share it and like it. It's like a slot in the fence or a hole in the, ha in the fence.